Didn't have a chance. Oh. Oh! Did I just see a Ceratosaurus take out an Indominus Rex? I sure did. Wow, that would have not been on my bingo card. Super Raptor here, and welcome to the first Jurassic World Evolution 2 Battle Royale. So, it's been one of those things I've been wanting to get back into doing some of these for a while now, and because I enjoy making them, and you guys have absolutely loved them. And uh, fortunately for this one, I mean, we can do Battle Royales uh, not just on land, but we even got technically sea and air as well so uh we're gonna definitely be getting into a bit of all of that but anyways yeah so without further ado let me go ahead and uh, release all of the land-based dinosaurs here and uh we'll go ahead and get ourselves a battle royale started <laughs> all right well now finally uh the constant commentary has ended uh, we can actually probably kind of get into this now. So, just to give you guys a little bit of an idea of uh, what the dinosaurs are set up as. If they kind of had negative traits, I tried to kind of get rid of them. I mean, there's a few of them, I think, that still have, like, the aggressive trait. But for the most part, any kind of negative traits, uh, I tried to genetically remove from them. So, they're, for the most part, all pretty much uh, neutral. So, let me go ahead and uh, change the things so they can start fighting, and we'll get into it. Alright, well they can start fighting, so let's see what happens. Oh, looks. Looks like we already got one between the Giga and the Carcarodontosaurus. Oh yeah, oh, looks like uh, the Indom is already uh, attacking something as well. Let's go ahead and see how this goes. Got two big major carnivores duking it out right now. Alright, one hit already from the Carcarodontosaurus. Alright. Looks like the Giga's trying to Trying to make some shots, but is uh, kind of failing. The Allosaurus and the Spinosaurus are going at it. Looks like the Giga left. Uh, all right, well, both hurting pretty bad, but doesn't look like any kind of major damage. Let's uh, see how that went. Oh, looks like the Allosaurus is not doing well. Oh, well, that's not good. Don't know if it's uh, if it's anything that's. Oh no, let's see. Is it healing? Can't tell. No, it's healing. Okay, so it's not anything that I guess is uh, going to actually get a kill, but man, it, it took a beating from the Spinosaurus. What we got over here that's dead? Uh, looks like uh, the Proceratosaurus probably taken down by the Endoraptor. Uh, it looks like the Margosaurus. Okay. Endoraptor is hunting the Margosaurus. Okay. Let's watch this. Probably just going to go up and... Oh, yeah. Jumps on its back. Grabs the head and just snaps its neck. Just absolutely merciless. Completely gone. Alright, see, who else has we got here? Uh, what we got over here? The Polycanthus died with the from the Indominus Rex. So it's out of the battle as well. Alright. Uh see the Kamarasaurus is low health. Don't know what uh, it got into battle with. Oh! Oh! Wow! Indominus Rex just absolutely destroyed the uh, Arche uh, Archaeothomimus or whatever it is. I uh, can't pronounce it. Anyways, let's see. Uh, what we got here? Uh oh. Indoraptor is hunting down the Struthiomimus. This is probably not going to go well for it, but man, it. I give that Struthiomimus a little bit of credit. It is running for its life right now. <laughs> It's now it's being hunted and it is trying to get away, but uh, the Indoraptor is not exactly known for being, you know, from backing down from anything. And it looks like we got our uh, fluorescent uh, Parasaurolophus over here. <laughs> Still running around. Nice to see. Well,. Oh, it's chasing it down. Let's go see what the uh, Indominus Rex is doing. Taking down this Apatosaur. Snapping at its legs. But it's not down, actually. That's surprising. It didn't actually take it down. It hurt it. 
Uh, it is still losing health, though, so it might be bleeding out. So it may actually not survive. Alright, let's see. Uh, oh, back to it again. Alright, well, it, the Indominus Rex is not done with the Apatosaurus, it looks like. Once again, grabbing it, tearing at the leg. And again, still not down, though. The Apatosaurus is really putting up a fight against the Indominus Rex. This is not something I would have expected. I figured it would have already had it taken down. Alright, ooh, let's see here. What we got over here? What kind of injury? On what? Let's see, the Herrerasaurus has been injured. Is the health going down, though, is the question. The health is going down, so it might be out. Velociraptor is in a fight. Alright. Oh! Nice clawing. I do believe this is, uh, Soropelta, yes. Oh! That was a good comeback on the Soropelta's part. Just, you know, completely knocking the raptor over, but the raptor does not look like it wants to give up. But when we let the dinosaurs uh, fight, okay, well, we maybe it is. Them, <laughs> Let's see, the is the health going down? Nope, the Soropelta is healing, them. so it's still not out of the fight here. Alright, well, uh-oh, looks like we got a fight over here between the Acro and the Scorpius Rex. Okay, yeah, so this would be an interesting one. It looks like the Scorpius Rex is already poisoned. Ooh, nice tail hit. Uh, it's already poisoned the Acrocanthosaurus, so even if it does get away, it's probably not going to do well. Ooh, the health is bad on the Scorpius Rex, though. The uh, Acrocanthosaurus definitely did some damage, and it is going down, so this, the Scorpius Rex might be out of this battle. Let's see here. What we got going on over here? Oh, okay. It looks like the Carcharodontosaurus uh, just took out the Chasmosaurus, so it's now out of it. Let's see, what we got here? Okay, we already know that one. Let's see. We have a uh, another. Did I put two acros in? Oh, no, never mind. That was the acro. Was, uh, the acro is now chasing down the Gallimimus. So let's see if uh, see if he can grab it. Oh, just grabbed it and just completely crushed it. Looks like the Indominus Rex is getting into a fight with the Dreadnoughtus. Let's see. You gonna, uh... You gonna do anything here? <laughs> and, oh, there it goes. Alright. And just ripping at the leg. Alright, the, uh, Ceratosaurus that gets going after the Brachiosaurus. Again, doing the same thing. Trying to pull at those legs. Brachiosaurus just towers over that Ceratosaurus, though. It, in compa size comparison, is really, really tremendous. Let's see here. Looks like they've got a Metrocanthosaurus. And it is tracking down... Oh, the Stiggy Moloch! Wow, it didn't even have a chance. Didn't even give it anything at all. The Allosaurus now, it looks like, is uh, going after the Mementiosaurus. And there it goes. Ooh, and it, the Mitchisaurus looks like it's already in bad shape as it was. Uh, looks like the Indominus Rex is going back after the Dreadnoughtus again. And indeed it is. They are wearing down the sore pods very, very quickly. Just not giving them anything at all. Just they're kind of easy targets. Oh, and man. How much longer is this, uh, this Mementiosaurus going to be able to last? How's the Scorpius Rex doing? It's still slowly, uh, like it's still slowly bleeding out. So, unfortunately, I'm not sure if it's got much time left. Alright, Albertosaurus. Looks like it's going after... I don't even know what it went after. It just ate it whole. <laughs> Well, uh, whatever it just ate, uh, is no longer in the, uh, field at all. <laughs> oh, it looks like the Kamarasaurus did indeed go down. Let's see, how's our Spinosaurus doing? Spinosaurus is doing quite well, so... Uh, yep, yeah, looks like the, uh, Scorpius Rex is starting to lie down here. Uh, the Dreadnoughtus looks like, yep, it was fatally wounded by the Indominus Rex, so it is now out of the battle as well. 
Uh, Mementiosaurus is bleeding out, so it will probably die here very, very soon. So it is also out. Let's see, Brachiosaurus, same thing. It is bleeding out. It does not have much left in it. All right, so there is... Let's see, how's the uh, Acrocanthosaurus doing? Because it was poisoned by the Scorpius Rex. Surprisingly, its health is just now getting to kind of a, a bad point. So I wonder if it'll actually be able to pull through or not. That'll be interesting to see. Okay. Wow, surprisingly, the Trilodon actually died of thirst. I would have not guessed that. I mean, that's why there's a gigantic lake in the middle of the place. But, uh, hey, I guess it is what it is. I mean, you keep running away, it's going to happen. All right. Oh, let's see here. Indominus Rex, like it's going after the Draco Rex. And probably just going to be, uh... Nope, not going to eat it. Oh, I figured it'd probably become a little bit of a snack. It's like the Diplodocus and, uh, being attacked by... Or, no, okay, that's the, uh, Dilophosaurus. It looks like it's attacking... I'm not sure what this is. Uh, the Myosaurus. Okay, that's interesting. All right, let's see how this works out, because uh, the Myosaurus is much bigger than the uh, Dilophosaurus here. Oh, jumps on it. Basically, it's clawing it like a raptor? Well, that's, um, that's rather interesting. Oh, and it actually made it fall. Oh, it is not looking good. The Myosaurus is getting absolutely destroyed by the uh, Dilophosaurus. Was not quite expecting that. Well, let's see, is it bleeding out or not? Are you losing health? Whenever a dinosaur dies. It is slowly losing like health, so it may actually be gone. That was interesting. I was not expecting a Dilophosaurus of all things to take down a Myasaur. And honestly, it didn't even get hurt at all, surprisingly, even though it got knocked off. So, rather interesting. Oh, well, not a lot of action going on right this moment, but, uh... Looks like a Spinosaurus is coming to get a little bit of a snack. Felt like I had to put some pescivore feeders in there because, uh... Yeah, they can eat meat, but they are mainly fish eaters, so... Okay, looks like, uh, Dilophosaurus... Oh! And the Coelophysis were getting into a fight, and the Dilophosaurus just took it out like it was nothing. Wow, absolutely insane. Like, the Dilophosaurus has been just extremely aggressive in this. Let's see. Two fights, yeah. And it's basically had, well, it's had one kill, but, uh... The Myosaurus, we know, is probably going to die of its wounds because it is slowly bleeding out. So the Lophosaurus actually has gotten basically two kills. Very surprising. Uh-oh. Okay, looks like, uh... Looks like our Sucomimus is about to get into a fight with the Indominus Rex. Don't really feel like that's probably a good fight to pick, but, uh, hey. You get what you're gonna get. Oh, and there it is. Ah. Oh. Brutal takedown by the Indominus Rex. Just completely destroyed the Sucomimus. And, uh, yep, there you go. Get yourself a victory snack. You deserve it. Okay, so it looks like the Velociraptor is still in this. The Giga is still in this. Uh, and, oh, the Acrocanthosaurus got into a fight with a T-Rex and lost. Okay, oh, we got the Majungasaurus and the Metriacanthosaurus going at it. And the Metricanthosaurus really does not look like it's in good shape. Yep. It it was just completely destroyed by the Majungasaurus. It's taken down like it was absolutely nothing. Honestly, I am really surprised that the Diplodocus here has not even been touched. That That's very surprising. Okay, looks like uh, we might be having a fight line up here between the Giga and the uh, Sauropelta. We've got another fight over here. Between the Allosaurus and the Nasutoceratops. See how these kind of go. We'll try to try to keep an eye on both of them. Oh! And there it is. Allosaurus just completely wiped it out. So let's get over here. Uh oh, yep, never mind. <laughs> Looks like the Giga just completely demolished the Sauropelta. Just didn't have a chance. Okay, it looks like oh! Cryolophosaurus, man, just completely demolished the Corythosaurus. Didn't have a chance. Oh! Oh! 
Did I just see a Ceratosaurus take out an Indominus Rex? I sure did. Wow, that would have not been on my bingo card. Wow, that was absolutely insane. I would have never guessed a Ceratosaurus would have taken down an Indominus Rex. Absolutely insane. Just goes to show you that literally anything can happen in these battles. Alright, looks like Rexy is still in the game here and at 100% health. Wow, one of, uh, uh-oh, let's see what we got here. Megalosaurus versus the Iguanodon. Ooh, first hit by the Iguanodon. Iguanodon's definitely not going to go down easy. Oh, but a return by the Megalosaurus. And, wow, just got stabbed by that thumb from the Iguanodon. Let's see, is its health going down, though? Nope, it is going up. The Iguanodon is not out of this battle just yet. Alright, uh, looks like Albertosaurus is getting ready to, uh, or was in a fight with the uh, Critonosaurus, but it uh, looks like it kind of went out unscathed. Alright, the Carnotaurus is going after the Edmontosaurus, and oh, just, ooh, knocked it over, and wow, with a nice little roll, hops right back up and takes the kill. Alright. Well, looks like we had a uh, fight between the Quajosaurus. Wow, that's a mouthful. Taking out the gigantic Spinosaurus. Well, I guess it's a good thing they got rid of that bug from the last game. <laughs> Alright, good job, man. Get yourself a good meal. Alright, we got another one here. Or... I say had another one here. Looks like the Carcarodontosaurus just completely destroyed the Crylophosaurus. Ooh. Oh! Brutal takedown by the Giga on the Ceratosaur. Wow. Man, I swear, this is stuff I would not guess. Ceratosaurus killing an Indom and then turns around and gets killed by a Giga, of all things. Just absolutely insane. Would have never guessed any of this. Oh, that's rather interesting. Much to my surprise, looks like the Nigersaurus is still alive. That's uh, rather interesting. I think it might actually be the only sauropod left that we have alive. Let's see. Allosaurus and Baryonyx. Oh. Well, uh, apparently the Baryonyx didn't fare very well. <laughs> looks like the Allosaurus took it down without much trouble. Of course, uh, if we remember right, the Allosaurus was definitely a very dominant alpha predator from the first one. So it's not entirely surprising. Hey. Oh! Oh! Wow, there we go. Just like that. You get a fight from the Carcarodontosaurus, and it just doesn't give the Iguanodon anything. Just completely brutally took it down. And then it immediately attacks a ranger team. <laughs> All right, let's look at Bertosaurus and Majungasaurus are getting into it. See how this goes. Okay, a hit from the Albertosaurus. Majungasaurus does not be looking good. A little bit of a hit right back from the Majungasaurus, so it's not going to go down easy. It's really interesting, though. It's more just like the carnivores fighting each other. They're not really attacking the herbivores that are left. And just like that, the Albertosaurus took down the Majungasaurus, Velociraptor, and the Dilophosaurus are going at it. Oh, and wow, Velociraptor was not having it. Just completely took it out. Ah, uh, looks like our Dryosaurus was also hunted down by the Velociraptor as well. So, wow, the Velociraptor's starting to put in some work a little bit. Trying to take out what it can. Pocky is actually still in it. It's, that's surprising. Some of these uh, that I would not expect to be in it this late are actually still running around in it. Alright, looks like the Velociraptor and the Packy are going at it. Let's see how this turns out. Looks like uh, the Packy's already gotten a hit. And the Raptor's actually not doing too well itself, actually. So, oh, and they are breaking it off. Yep, that's probably at least a little bit of a smart idea. But, uh, oh no, the Packy. Packy's doing well. I was looking at the comfort. That was my mistake. It does look like the Velociraptor, though, is healing. So, yeah, the Velociraptor is uh, at least being a little bit resilient and uh, sticking into this battle. All right. Looks like uh, the Carcarodontosaurus is actually attacking the Diplodocus here. It's kind 
have about time, to be honest. I was uh, surprised it's been in this for so long without actually being attacked. It, and the Nigrosaurus both, is they are both really easy targets for the carnivores. And it looks like it is now starting to bleed. Looks like uh, Carnotaurus is going after the Nigrosaurus. So, speaking of the devil, like immediately after it happens. Oh! Oh! And the Carnotaurus didn't give the Nigrosaurus anything. It didn't even fight back. Just completely just took it down like it was nothing. And it looks like uh, Allosaurus is now going after the uh, Diplodocus. It wants a piece of it too. They are just putting the pain on that Diplodocus, and it is just starting to rapidly bleed out. And it's going to go ahead and hit it again for a third time, so it, this is not going to go well for the Diplodocus. I think uh, this might be pretty much the end of the sauropods here, because it is the last one remaining. And there it goes. Biting of the leg, ripping and tearing it out. Just bleeding this guy out. Like, I mean, it, it's just, it's no way this thing is going to last much longer. It is rapidly declining. It's bleeding out so quickly. Yeah, it's it's going to drop anytime now. And wow, the Allosaurus just being completely unforgiving is just making that bleeding worse and worse. And here it goes. Last few bits of health and. Is it going to drop? Yep, it's lying down now to just die. There it goes. There is the last of the sauropods. Wow, and immediately after the Allosaurus starts going after the trike. Maybe? No, okay. Oh, yep, yep. Oh, wow. That was a nasty, uh, nasty, well calculated hit there by the Allosaurus. Ooh, couldn't quite get one in on that one, though. Triceratops is definitely fighting back. It's not letting the uh, Allosaurus get away so easy, but, man, looks like the, Alli the the Triceratops is not doing very well. It is hurting. Is it bleeding? Let's see here if its health is going up or down. It is going down. Okay, so... Triceratops is probably out of it because it is at least slowly bleeding out. It's got some sort of uh, life-threatening injury. So, oh, looks like uh, Queen Xiaosaurus is uh, going after our Sinoceratops here. Looks like they're uh, finally starting to target some of the extra herbivores rather than each other. Uh, oh, okay. It's running off. Is it bleeding out, though? Let's see. Nope, it is healing, so the Sinoceratops is not out of this. The Aquatijalosaurus, though, is still at full health. Okay, it looks like the Carcarodontosaurus is hunting down the Allura Titan. Oh! Wow, that was such a brutal takedown. Literally grabbed it by the neck and just threw such a massive dinosaur over on its side and just snapped its neck. Wow, didn't even stand a chance. Uh-oh. Wow. Oh, that was a quick fight between the Megalosaurus and the Giga. Wow, it looks like uh, the Giga didn't even give it a chance. Just completely took out the Megalosaurus like it was nothing. Uh-oh. Uh, it looks like uh, the Giga's getting into a fight with the Taurosaurus over here. And it looks like our uh, Torgesser kind of get caught up in the middle of it. Ooh, Torosaurus though, not uh, not giving anything. Put a little bit back into it. Looks like uh, Velociraptor is also getting into a fight here with the Para. See if we can uh, chase it down and take it out. It's catching up, and there it is, caught on, and it is tearing into the Para. Ooh, that didn't look good though. Just got kicked off by it. Wow, and uh, actually the parents some, somehow didn't uh, get any uh, any damage from that. But the raptor sure did. Let's see here. Is the raptor going to heal, though? That's the big question. Does say it has an undiagnosed element. Nope, it isn't. It is slowly going down, which means 
It's probably got some organ trauma or something like that. Oh, and immediately gets into a fight with the Deinonychus. Oh, it, it, and it's full health. Okay, this is not going to go good for the Raptor. Yep. And just like that, the Deinonychus took out the Velociraptor. So the so one Raptor takes out another Raptor. There you go. Uh, I guess you got to give the, uh, the Deinonychus a little bit of credit, though. It saw an opportunity to take down a, a foe, and it pounced on it. Uh, and it looks like, indeed, the Giga did take out the Taurosaurus. So it is now out of the fight. Uh, so I just went ahead and removed the uh, pesky board feeders. Uh, the Spinosaurus has actually been in a battle. Uh, it's been in a couple battles, actually. But I feel like uh, it's not participating as much as it should. So uh, I do believe it can still technically eat meat. So... I'm going to take away its uh, its feeder, so hopefully they'll start getting into a little bit more battles and instead of just kind of uh, living off the work of everybody else here. It's like uh, Carnotaurus is getting ready to take down the Alora Titan. Will it knock it over like before? Yep, absolutely. Ugh. Same brutal tactic as before. Spinosaurus and Sinoceratops are now getting into it. Ooh, and the Sinoceratops does not look good. Already down to 30% health, and uh, Spinosaurus is at full. Oh, but they're actually calling it off. I didn't expect that. But are you uh, are you fatally injured? That's the question. No, you are not. You are actually gaining health. So the Sinoceratops, surprisingly, still in the fight. Uh-oh. Looks like the Spinosaurus and the Giga are getting into it. Ooh, nice shot by the Spinosaurus. See how the Giga... Oh, and the Giga returns. Oh, they are really getting into it. But it looks like uh, the Giga is not doing very well. Spinosaurus looks like it is healing. How about the Giga? Is it healing? That is the question. It is healing. So it looks like both of them are still into it. They're both in the game yet. They're not out of it. There will still be another fight. Uh-oh. It's like uh, the Rex and Quangiosaurus are getting into it. If I had to guess, I feel like Rexy's probably going to have at least a little bit. Ooh, just knocking that uh, tour bus. Ooh, Rexy's actually hurt, surprisingly. Oh, nice hit by Rexy. And a return. Wow, this is actually a bigger fight than I would have expected it to be. Uh, looks like Quangiosaurus, though, is... Uh, is running over back. Let's see. How's Rexy doing? Rexy is healing. What about you? You are also healing. So both of them are still in it, surprisingly. Uh-oh. Looks like the Carnotaurus and, and Rexy are about to get into it. Let's see. Rexy has not fully recovered either, so this may not actually go well for Rexy. See how this fares. Ooh, in the first strike by the Carnotaurus. Got Rexy already. Ooh, that is not looking good. Oh, Rexy replies with a nasty bite. And Carnotaurus headbutts Rexy. Rexy's not doing good. Ooh. It is not out of it, though. Oh, it is. Rexy may have left, but uh, Rexy is uh, all right. Wow, Giga decided to take out the Centaurosaurus. So it is now out of it. We are now down to probably about a dozen dinosaurs left. Let's see here. How's, uh, see how our others are doing. Where's Rexy at? Are you losing health? Nope, Rexy is gaining back health, so Rexy is still not out of the battle. How about the Carnotaurus? Looks like you're probably gaining, if I had to guess. Yep, Carnotaurus, man, both of them very, very resilient predators. That looks like Spinosaurus and the uh, Sinosaurus are getting back into it. Let's see, the health of the Sinoceratops is not good, and Spinosaurus is actually doing quite well, but... Did just get a little bit of a hit. Oh, that health is bad. There's no way that that Sinoceratops is making it. And now it looks like the Carcarodontosaurus 
or I'm sorry, the Giga and the Albertosaurus are getting into it. Ooh. Wow, Giga is hurt. So is the Albertosaurus. But the Albertosaurus is bleeding out slowly. So looks like the Albertosaurus is now going to actually be out of the battle. How about our Giga? How you doing? Ooh, the Giga is bleeding out as well. So those two have effectively just slowly killed each other. Looks like the Stegosaurus and the Quayan Jowsaurus are getting into it. Looks like uh, the Stegosaurus has already taken some nasty hits. And the Quayan Jowsaurus is still doing all right. Ooh, well, that one hurt. That one didn't do good. And uh, if we look back there, Rexy is hunting down the Motoburosaurus as well. Oh, brutal takedown by Rexy. Just grabbed it and just completely just whipped it to the ground. Just completely destroying it. The Stegosaurus here is very low health. Uh, let's see. How's the... And you're healing? And there, I, I get a good feeling the Stegosaurus is not going to heal. Probably going down, right? No, it is. Surprisingly. Wow. The Stegosaurus is actually healing. Oh, missed that one for the Spinosaurus. Let's see if we can find it really quick. Looks like it's over here. Uh, what did it take down? Oh, it took down the Para. So... Para is now out of it, taken down by the Spinosaurus. Ooh. Oh! Wow. That was a last second uh, catch there, but, uh, wow. Connor Taurus just took out Rexy. Like, Rexy was nothing. That's surprising, because it's a much smaller one. And, uh, this is, uh, probably unfortunate for the Sinoceratops. Uh, well, okay. Well, they were going to supposedly get into a fight, but, uh, I guess decided not to. Uh, because we know the Giga is slowly dying, and the Sinoceratops was actually healing before. Uh, and it is once again healing, surprisingly. Wow, very, very resilient dinosaur. Gotta give it some credit on that. It, I was not expecting it to survive so many fights. Not without a fatal energy. Okay, it looks like the Carcarodontosaurus is getting into a fight with the Anki over here. Uh, it looks like it did some serious damage to the Anki. Let's see, is it healing or not? That's kind of the big question here. It is not. So the Anki is actually going to be out of the battle. It will probably bleed out to death. How about the Carcarodontosaurus? It is healing. So it is still well within this battle. Oh, it looks like the Giga and the Albertosaurus want to just kind of finish it off. I do believe these two were the ones that uh, got into a nasty fight earlier and pretty much killed each other. So I guess what they want to find out who's going to be the actual victor. Even though they have very little health, it's pretty much going to be probably whoever gets first hit, if I had to guess. These two definitely do not like each other. circling he's gonna make the first shot oh and there it goes from the giga albertosaurus is now down to 13 percent oh and a reply from the albertosaurus it's like not gonna go down easy who's gonna be the victor four percent Ooh, this is close these two really do not like each other they injured they both fatally injured each other but they they really do not want uh, want the other to be there. So bad that they are willing to get into a fight. But uh, I would say the Giga probably wins between them because the Albertosaurus is probably, yeah, pretty much just laying down to die at this point. Yep, 2%. Nope. Spinosaurus and the, uh, the Warosaurus are now getting into it. Ooh. Spinosaurus gets hit. 89% health. Let's see, 61 on the Warosaurus. See here, how's this gonna happen? Oh, Warosaurus is not gonna go down so easily, but uh, oh, it is injured. Let's see, is it fatally injured though? That's the question. It is not. So the Warosaurus is actually still not out of this. How's the Spinosaurus looking? Uh, Spinosaurus is healing, so all right, well, 
They're both still in it, although the Warosaurus did take a really, really big hit. Uh-oh. Looks like the Aquarianjosaurus is getting ready to try to take on the Spinosaurus. Somehow I get a feeling the Spinosaurus probably has a bit of an advantage here. Bit of a bigger uh, carnivore. Wow, that was a heck of a hit. Ouch! Man, the, the Aquarianjosaurus is just getting destroyed here. The Spinosaurus hasn't even been touched. Oh, but it's not going to go down without at least a little bit of a fight. Nice bite on it. Let's see. I get a feeling it's probably... It's not fatal, actually, though. It got very, very close to dying, but uh, the Quangiosaurus, surprisingly, did not get a, fa you know, a, a fatal uh, wound. So that's interesting. How about the, our Spino? Spino's just fine as well. Very, very surprising. Okay, it looks like uh, our Allosaurus is getting ready to get into a fight with the Sinoceratops, which surprisingly has been very resilient. Oh, wow, really? That easy? Dang! That, uh, that's very surprising as well. I mean, Sinoceratops has been very, very resilient in, in its battles, but man, it just got completely destroyed by the Allosaurus. Oh, and dang, Carcarodontosaurus just takes the Quangiosaurus down like it was absolutely nothing. And it was in the Quangiosaurus has actually been a very, very resilient uh, fighter in this battle. So, yeah, very interesting. Uh oh, Carnotaurus and. Oh, wow, the Warosaurus just got destroyed by the Carnotaurus. I have to admit, the Carnotaurus is actually putting in some serious work in this battle. It has really started to step up its game. All right, so we're down to pretty much the last few. And uh, the Stegosaurus over here is literally the last herbivore left. So it's... Uh, the battles are spark should start to get pretty nasty. Oh, Carnotaurus and Allosaurus. Looks like they're about to uh, to go at it here. All right, looks like the Stegosaurus and the Allosaurus are about to get into a battle. So let's see how this turns out. Oh, wow. Allosaurus is getting hit with those Thagomizers from the uh, Stegosaurus. That is definitely not good. Oh, but a nasty return back. Uh-oh. This isn't starting to look so good for the Allosaurus. Okay, looks like they're calling it off. The question is, though, are either of them fatally wounded? The Stegosaurus sure isn't, but how's the Allosaurus doing? Allosaurus is also recovering, so while it uh, still ha may have a wound, it's, uh, it's not out of this battle just yet. Okay, it looks like the Carnotaurus and the Spinosaurus are about to get into it. Oh, and a quick bite there by the Spinosaurus. And, ooh, a headbutt return from the Carnotaurus. And Spinosaurus bites back. The Carnotaurus is not looking too good in this fight. But it's definitely not going down without a fight. It gives it another headbutt. And let's see here. How are you doing? Are you bleeding out? And... Yep. Carnotaurus is bleeding out, so the Carnotaurus is now out of the battle. And we are down pretty much to the wire at this point. The Spinosaurus is starting to heal. Uh, that means with the Spinos or the Carnotaurus being out of it, we're down to pretty much the last five dinosaurs. And who would have guessed? One of them was the Stegosaurus. And yes, indeed, it looks like the Carnotaurus has finally decided to lay down and uh, just pass. And of course, in uh, Carnotaurus, you know, passion, decides to lay down right in the middle of the path. <laughs> Why? Just because it can. The most defining feature of the Carnotaurus. Um. Yeah. Okay. Let's let's just ignore them and uh, yeah. There you go. Just push them out of the way. Get yourself a good snack. <laughs> oh, gotta love it. 
<laughs> Ooh, and the car car Dontosaurus just ran off the Spinosaurus. Everybody's wanting a piece of that uh, of that Carnotaurus just because everybody is hungry right now. Uh Wow, he actually didn't get any food from that. That's interesting. Looks like he was in is eating. Oh, and just like that, the Spinosaurus and the Carcarodontosaurus are getting into a fight. Oh, first shot from the Carcarodontosaurus. Not looking good for the Spinosaurus already. Looks like it's already seriously injured. Carcarodontosaurus is doing far better. Oh! Oh, down just like that there goes the spinosaurus taken down by the car car Dontosaurus. wow would have not expected that but hey let's be honest the car car Dontosaurus has been a very very aggressive predator in this entire battle let's see how's your uh, health doing are you going down or up oh oh that sucks your health is going down. Wow. Well, it's a temporary victory for the Carcarodontosaurus. It was doing so very well. It even managed to take down the Spinosaurus, but um, it looks like in the process it sustained an injury that is just going to have it slowly bleed out and die. Wow. Unexpected, but... Hey. Yeah. Oh, wait. Is it going back up now? Hold up. Oh, its health is going back up. Okay, so that might have just been because it was starving. Alright, well. Our car, Dr. Source, I guess, uh, actually is still in it then. Man, you gotta love the, uh... <laughs> you gotta love the pile up of four buses right here. <laughs> Okay, it looks like the Allosaurus and the Carcarodontosaurus are about to get into it. Uh, ooh, the Allosaurus is not doing well, though. Oh! Oh, wow. Just... Ah, absolutely brutal. Carcarodontosaurus didn't give the Allosaurus even a chance. That, on the other hand, could you all imagine what that view would have been like, uh... <laughs> from the tour buses? That'd be epic. You know what? We're gonna have to actually do a battle royale where we pretty much do everything or review it all from the tour buses. I think that's gonna be a thing. That that should definitely be a thing. That would be awesome to see. <laughs> wow, so the Allosaurus is out of it. Looks like the Carcarodontosaurus uh, is there, plus the Stego and the Deinonychus. So those are the three left. Who would have guessed? I mean, th this has just been absolutely insane. It's not quite over yet, but man, absolutely insane. Uh, I'm getting a feeling, though, like by itself, the Deinonychus is not going to attack, so... It's probably going to be one of our uh, victors for, I guess, these small dinosaurs. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, it, it'll be one of our victors, but uh, I get a feeling the Carcarodontosaurus is probably going to be our victor here. Because um, pretty much it's the only real competition left is the Stegosaurus. So, we'll see how that turns out. Alright, guys. So... This is the way it's kind of looking right now. Uh, we pretty much just have the Deinonychus, we have the Carcarodontosaurus, and we have the Stegosaurus. Now, one of the things I've kind of looked at is if we go in here, uh, is kind of neutral towards the Stegosaurus. And I get a feeling the Deinonychus won't attack unless it has a pack, uh, which it doesn't, you know, for the purposes of this particular battle royale. So we're going to move the Carcarodontosaurus and the Stegosaurus into a tiny little enclosure here to see if we can uh, maybe force a, uh, a battle between the two. Because, let's be honest, a Deinonychus isn't going to take out either one of those by itself. 
Alright, looks like we might uh, have a fight between the Stegosaurus and the Carcarodontosaurus. We do indeed. Alright. Well, I guess let's see. Uh... Ooh. First hit by the Stegosaurus with those Thagmizers. Did the... Oh my god! I was not expecting that. <laughs> One shot from the Stegosaurus. Are you kidding me? The Stegosaurus just took out the Carcarodontosaurus with a single hit. <laughs> I was not expecting that at all. Oh my god. Well, I um I guess I don't listen I don't think the Deinonychus is going to attack the Stegosaur, but I guess um you all I give to you all your first ever Jurassic World Evolution 2 Battle Royale Victor. It's a Stegosaurus. I would have never guessed this. This is absolutely insane. But anyways, guys, this is your main victor. Your uh, Deinonychus is, uh, I guess, our little little cup victor or whatever. But yeah, anyways, guys, if you like the video, be sure to pounce on that like button. And if you haven't already, join the pop by subscribing below. Have a good day, everyone.